<laughs> bananas. <laughs> bananas. Oh boy. That banana is throbbing. It throbs. Well, anyway, uh, let's get this music turned off. <laughs> it's so silly. Anyway, uh, I'll get this music turned off for everyone while we're here in Banana World. Anyway, good afternoon and evening, everyone. That's just made the day. It's home day. It's a weird, weird home day. Sip. September 4th, 2024, day 248. I'm all jacked up on Mountain Dew! If you're wondering why I'm in a world of bananas, and it's literally just called Banana World, with an exclamation mark. Uh, th there's some context to this one, some uh, very interesting and possibly somewhat annoying context. It happened yesterday, though. But it happened after I was done recording yesterday. Um, remember how we talked about that crab that keeps getting into our house? Well, we learn that this cat goes into multiple neighbors' houses. And I, I, I've counted no less than five houses this cat will go into. So five different people have this cat going into their house. And as I was, uh, was it while I was editing yesterday or was it after I got back from the store? I think it was I think it was while I was editing yesterday's video. Lily was outside with Buttercup and Sweet Bee, and she just hears, "What are you doing with the banana?" And then she looks over, and the cat is this the black cat that keeps getting into our house was darting out of the neighbor's house across the street. So he was darting out of their house and it had a banana and started pouncing on it. So. This cat is... Oh, oh, and, and I also learned that he's also been stealing Buttercup socks, so this cat is a bonafide cat burglar. Yep. It's quite bananas, I'll admit. It is very bananas. I mean, I stole a banana from the neighbor. Stole their very needed potassium. They do a lot of outdoor work. I don't know, but... <laughs> I guess I should start and say that today is just eh, a calm. It's a, it's a calm hump day, or you know Wednesday. Buttercup had a short day at school today, but that's because doctor's appointment stuff came up again. I really, I really need a workaround for this because we cannot have last year, last school year, repeat this year as well. It was a real problem, and I feel like it set Buttercup back a little bit. She's catching up, but she is in trouble right now. She... I'm... I, uh, when I came back from the store yesterday, or when Tara came back from the store yesterday, he was asking if she did her homework because he did hear that, uh, that her new teacher has a policy that if they don't do their homework, they lose, like, four recess periods. Which is, which to me is unreasonably high because... Well, when you work at when when you're oh in of when when you have a job and it's full time, you're required to have breaks. Yeah, for some reason, school is circumvent that say no, the school they're not being paid, therefore they can't have any breaks. So I can understand the need for a punishment when you're not doing your homework, but it shouldn't be excessive either. But still, that that's beside the point. She's in trouble because she told Tara. That she did do her homework. So, Tara started asking Lily if she checked. And, and then, after being told that she did her homework and that it was checked, Lily said no. She left her homework packet at school. Which means Buttercup is in trouble for lying to Tara about doing her homework. She needs to be doing her homework. And she can't be conveniently leaving in his school like she did last year. We don't want that set. I just had a banana go through my head. But we can't have the same problems as last year. Repeat. Stop going through my head. Hmm. This is bananas. But we don't, we just don't want the same problems repeating again. So we're just gonna put a stamp on it, you know, increase the strictness where we have to. And 
um, I'm starting with this banana. Hang on. Oh, I dropped it that way. Well, it's out of this world now. It's back. Let's see if I can, uh... I keep throwing it backward. Well, oh, it's out of the world again, so it should be coming back in a moment. There it is. Well, yeah, that's the story of why we're in a banana world. I thought about going somewhere else, too, but I was like, where else, where else would I be able to go? I mean, there are a whole lot of new worlds we can just go to right now. I mean, they, they're kind of are. But at the same time, like, the one thing that I will say is that the lighting for some of the new worlds that are out right now are, um, some poor lighting. And part of that is... Well, they do really well lighting. They're not good for for this lighting. Look at them. I, I'm I, I'm not lit up enough. I'm not glowing. I'm not glowing too much. Nor am I glowing too little. But there are a lot of new worlds I've gone to. It's so bad you can barely see. Like like that um that exoplanet journey world that Terra likes to go to. That world has extremely bad lighting where you can barely see someone's face. And, well, there are a lot of worlds like that right now. Let me take a look. There are a few new worlds. This one's not new. I thought about going to Do Not Press the Button, which is listed under New and Noteworthy. But the problem was, it's got Peter Griffin on it, and I don't want to go to a world where suddenly you just fear Peter Griffin. And I was going to go to a world called The Door. But in order to turn the music off, you have to open the door. I guess I can go there real quick. Hang on. You'll see what I mean, but I, I have world music turned off. So, I'll just go ahead and go. We're done with bananas. That cat, that cat, though, was... I'm gonna have to do something about stealing, about them stealing Buttercup's socks. The hard Buttercup needs to start keeping her socks in the house instead of leaving them outside. That would be helpful. But here's the door. Wait a minute. What? My house. Huh? What? Uh, let's see. Hang on. See, yes. Oh. That's interesting. Let me turn this camera off. What? Oh, well, that's interesting. This is the door, but, uh, okay. So, then, there is world music here, but in order to turn it off, you have to open the door. So, I'll just go ahead and turn the world music on and then mute it when I get in there. Ow, that's really loud in my ear right now. We go. Takes a little bit of effort. Interesting. Maybe the world's not fully complete or something, but hang on. You look through here. You look there. But it still looks just about the same. Huh. That's an interesting effect, especially since it has that up there, but you can only see it through this camera. Hang on. Oh dear. Well, anyway. This is the door. The problem is, how do I close the door? Uh, how do I close the door? Today's gonna be an interesting effect, though, because if you go through the door, you can see the piano that's over here. But if you go back out the door and then say go around the door, it's not there. This is an interesting effect. I kind of like that. This is kind of cool. But if you give you a bit of a bit of a bit of get some tide, apparently. But anyway, that's the interesting thing about this world, isn't it? Well, I'd say the bunny and then the door itself. I I I, I originally, well, Barra was originally gonna do try to make some kind of suspense horror short story about a door 
but it never happened. But that's because we we're, we're so easily distracted. There's so many projects we want to do that we just never do because we're so busy. Um, well, we are, we do get busy with the kids. We get busy mostly with being distracted. We, we just don't have the attention span anymore. Our attention span, it feels like it's been getting worse over the years. Especially in the recent... Two or three years, it feels like it's gotten just significantly worse. But, I, I guess that's just the whole thing about getting older. You constantly focus on, you know, what are the kids getting into this time? I mean, lately, uh, Sleepy's gotten into all the whales again, and, and, and the penguins. And a whole heap more other things, too. Ugh. Can't really complain too hard or anything. Uh, well, I guess I could, but I don't want to. What? My train of thought's going, kind of going all over the place again because I talked about the cat. I, I shut a door with the piano, but I'm gonna leave the world with the door. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back out the door. So now we can just stare at that thing, which if I look at it, it's not there, but I only see it through the camera. Like reverse vampirism or something. Reverse vampire. Are you a reverse vampire? Because I can't see you. Only the camera can. Uh, there's... I, I don't know what else I could talk about right now. Because... I haven't really... We haven't really played any games with any of our online friends. Uh... Sweet might be getting Animal Crossing taken away because she got one of the island villagers that Lily liked kicked off the island for a very ugly, you know, character. Like, does not like the new character that's in. And somehow Sweetly managed to do that. She's already cut down all the trees, Lily's trying to get them replanted. And Sweetly went and cut them all again by getting more axes. So. She did that. See, I'm not learning Smash Brothers right now, but her favorite thing to do is play as Sonic and then immediately jump to her do. So her version of playing the game is... Sudoku. Well, really, Seppuku, but, you know, all old meme, old streaming meme from... five years ago was Sudoku. Uh, you can ask Soups VR, but what, I don't think Soups was there for that one. No. Oh. Ah, I even forgot who I was there. My memory hits me. It was, it was more of Soups the R's friends, though. It's like we met them through Soups. It's just been a very, very long time. We don't really hang out with a lot of people. Really, we... I, I, I can't even really say what all we do on our on our own off time. We, we just mainly take care of the kids. I cook in... Lately, I feel like I've been whacking in the cooking department. It's felt particularly bland. But anyway, that's enough of that. I've done enough rambling today. And luckily, so far, I haven't had to deal with a cat trying to get into our house today, which means maybe he's preoccupied with other houses right now. We're, no, we're, we're, we're leaving, Mr. Hermit. Sing Bunny, I can't see what you are from this far away. I can try to get closer, but I can't look at you, so bye. Yeah, this is Tessa Spade on your hump day. It, you know, the whole hump day, September 4th, 2024, day 248. And we will see you all tomorrow on Thursday. Please take care, and we'll see you tomorrow. So long, everyone.